Looking for a fun-filled way to get into the holiday spirit, the Polar Express train ride at Big South Fork Scenic Railway opens this Friday. And joining us now is event manager Michelle Simpson and executive director Crystal Taylor. And they have a couple of other friends. I was going to say, they've got friends. some more people going yeah, on. Yeah, <laughs> we've got, who are the other folks you have there with you? We have our conductor, Tate, and our hero child, Tate. Oh, they're both Tate. Well, Tate, <laughs> good morning to you. We're so glad you're here with us. Oh, yeah, because the character, he, he, you know, progresses throughout the, yeah. That's right. Tell us a little bit about the, the Polar Express train ride that uh, the folks can come down there and check out. Well, uh, when you arrive, you'll be greeted by gold codes that will tell you exactly where you need to go. You'll get your tickets from the ticket window. You'll be presented with a gold ticket that uh, is very important during the train ride. Then we will start at uh, 30 minutes before uh, boarding with a pre-show uh, with actors such as Tate and Tate uh, and other actors too, like our hobo. Um, on the train cars, there'll be stewards that will dance for you, that will serve you hot chocolate and cookies. And it's just a really fun time. And not to mention, like the most important part of our show is Santa, who gives out the first gift at Christmas, the bell. And you all have a lot that goes into this. We were looking at the information. You all have around 350 volunteers. That's a lot of people taking part. part. Yes. Most um, um, Polar Express trains across the United States and in Europe, uh, they pay their actors. Uh, we do not. We, we are volunteer driven here only. That's incredible to be able to get that many people to come together for one good reason. But it's a it's a, an event all to itself and, and there's uh, nothing like it that, that you're going to find uh, around here right that's true very true tell us about the train itself what, what kind what kind of train is this it's a diesel engine um unfortunately you don't have the steam engine but we are diesel um, we have six cars that will pull um, we have a total capacity of we can hold pull over 300 guests on each um, trip and things are better this year. In years past here, the past couple of years have been kind of rough, I'm sure, for you all. But uh, this year, it's full steam ahead, right? Yeah, full steam. We don't have to, uh, you know, put different uh, empty seats in between or wear a mask, so we're very happy about that. How many different rides do you all do throughout the day for this? Um, we'll have 59 total trips during the season that we're doing this. Um, during the week, <clears throat> Mostly on Fridays is two. Saturdays we have four. On Sundays there'll be three trips. Okay, plenty of opportunities for folks to, to come down there. Tell, tell us what the atmosphere is like as, as everyone's loading up to get on the train. Oh, there's tons of excitement. Yeah, um, tons of excitement outside. The kids are all always extremely excited for the train ride. It's just a really good um, atmosphere for families. Now, is Santa before or after you get on the train? Oh, after we, we will go to the North Pole and Santa will get on the train at the North Pole, which is 30 minutes into the ride. That makes sense. You get on the Polar Express, <laughs> Santa's going to be there at the end. All yeah. right. And if people want uh, tickets, what's the best way to get those? You can call the ticket office at 606-376-5330. You can go on our website. There's two different websites. You can go to Stern's The Polar Express Ride. Dot com, or you can go to www.bsfsry.com. All right. Well, we sure do appreciate you all, and we can't wait to see Tate and Tate down there and uh, some, of the, as some of the 350 volunteers that uh, come down there to make it all magically come to life. We appreciate you all. Thank you so much.